are you doing? You doing good? Hello. You guys having a fun Wednesday? Oh, <gasps> Serena. Oh my god. It is for you. Oh my god, Serena. That's nuts. Thank you. That's crazy. That does not seem like four years. Oh my god. Thank you. That's so sweet of you. Jeez. You got the Lurgy tank? Oh, I got migraine too. I'm all dosed up on drugs. <laughs> Not, you know, legal ones. Don't worry. But you know what today is, don't you? At least I hope you guys know what today is. Oh, Burb! It's going to be great to have you with us. So today's optional theme for the community canvas, guys, is uh, your favourite video game characters. Whether it's like a new game, an old game, a game that you made up. Anything like that. But again, as always, it's optional. So uh, if you just want to draw whatever, that's allowed as well. That's cool. <gasps> where, where is it? That's a very good question, dude. I've been a dirty thief and I've been using it, yeah. There you go, sweet dog. Just making sure that's off. There we go. Africa, thank you for resubbing. You ate a banana split as reward for therapy. That sounds awesome. You got a filling to- Oh my god, guys, everything's been going on with you guys today. Jeez. Did your filling go okay, Serena? Steph hates it. I remember when we had her- She had her filling done, and uh, she was like, Oh, I want to film something afterwards. And like, half of her face was drooping. I was like, are you sure about this? And she was like, yeah. There's a video of me on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't feel a thing? Good, I'm glad. Right, there we go. I'm going to pop that in for you guys, and I'll pin it. Let me get that up there for you. Ooh, Panda Express. We don't have that here, Shuna, but I do hear it's pretty good. Jaden, you watched that video recently? I hope you liked it. <laughs> right, there we go. So again, as I say, optional prompt if you want to do it. Any kind of video game character because this week was all game themed but that's only optional so if you guys want to hang out and just draw whatever you can or if you just want to lurk or talk in the chat there ain't no rules you can do what you can do whatever you like the only rule is to have fun i don't know why i said that so aggressively the only rule is to have fun <laughs> you better have fun never <gasps> i freaking no I might try drawing Link, because I uh, he was one of my very first uh, favourite video game characters. And he's a boy! <gasps> I was very much of the case, like, growing up. There were definitely, like, girl characters in games and stuff, but I was, like, um, a typical boy, like, Oh, Zelda? She's lame. She's a girl. She literally gives you the most powerful weapon in the game. Oh, she's lame. <laughs> Zelda's lame. I don't like her. Oh, Lego says hi, Steph. Is Steph here? Are we are we being visited by the Queen? <laughs> by Queen Princess herself? Are you drawing a video game character? Mm -hmm. Zelda was kind of like. Well, she always needs saving, doesn't she? So do I. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you, are you saying that you're Zelda? Do you relate to her? <laughs> right, let's have a look at the brush. Because I like the egg one that's down here. Egg. Okay. Remember, we'll, draw, we'll do like a. Do a head. And uh, I'll do like I'll do like the indication of a body as well. There you go. Oh yes. <clears throat> you can't make it turned on by yourself by itself. Is that like a feature that it's supposed to have? <gasps> You're drawing an owl. Huh? <laughs> you know there are owls in Zelda too. 
I can't remember his name. Is it Ke Kabora Gabora? He, he has like a tongue twistery name. Kabora Gabora? Gabora Kabora? What's that owl's name? It turned on by itself. Sometimes, you know, I think our printer's haunted, because sometimes our printer, when we do accounts and stuff like that, that turns on by itself as well. It freaks me out. It always waits late at night as well. See if I can draw a link. Link. What kind of printer do we have? Um, it's just a black and white one. <laughs> it's so cheap. Because we just do it to print up accounts and stuff. It's literally the cheap. It doesn't do color at all. Kapora Gabora. That's it. Kapora Gabora. Like that, maybe? Let's, see. Let's, see. Let's have a little experiment with old Linky's face. <laughs> Printers stink nowadays. In my old job that I had, I we had one of those ones. You remember when printers had paper like this with the holes on the sides to like drag it through the printer? Uh, I I had to learn I had to learn how to use one of those, how to troubleshoot it when it went wrong, how to load the paper in. God, it was like the manual for that thing was like a bible. It was horrible. No one's allowed to complain about printers until you've learned how to feed a dot matrix printer. Then you'll really know how much they stink. I don't even know what that means. Don't, trust me, you don't need to worry. I will do everything in my power, hun, to avoid you ever having to deal with dot matrix printers. Oh, Froyo, that's cool looking. Oh, it, is that Blavers? <laughs> Blavers, it looks like he's getting ready to do a cheeky dab. <laughs> Blavers likes to dab in the, in the museum when there's no one watching. Look like a squishmallow. No, that's fine. No, he looks good. Is, is Blathers one of your favourite video game characters? Well, I like Animal Crossing in general, and I thought I'd just draw one of the characters. Oh, well, that's very sweet, dear. I'm so excited to see what video game characters you guys like. Because I feel like, I feel, these days, I feel completely clueless when it comes to, uh, games and stuff. I tend to pick one and play that for like six or seven years and then and then move on to like another yeah, one. Yeah, you get very into like a video game when you decide you like it. You play it for like years and years. Like Skyrim, that was one that you played. Yeah, I played Skyrim for a really long time. But that was because of the mods really. Bethesda's terrible. Awesome! Is that Among Us? Of course that's a game, isn't it? Among Us is a game, yeah. Isn't that meant to be like a new Skyrim game coming out. Oh, yeah, in like a thousand years. It won't come out for a really long time. But they're like, oh, we're working on it, I promise. But it's like, are you? Okay. Okay. Yep, working on it. Oh my god, Bean, is that Sonic? He looks so angry. I knew someone would do Sonic. <laughs> I'm glad he's he's gorgeous. He needs to be done. You post me? Yeah, we got a video games thing, Bow Bird, if you want to. We can put it in there. Hello, Brave Sean. How you doing? Do I know the game Paperboy? Yes, of course. Oh, my mum used to play that a lot. So I grew up with it. Do 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 do. I just throw you know in Paperboy to get more people to subscribe to your newspaper you have to break their windows <laughs> that's that's in the game you can look it up yeah to convert non-subscribers to subscribers in that game you have to smash their windows <laughs> it's serena it's true that's how you do it <laughs> never 
actually got that far in that game because I suffered it, but I enjoyed it. That's extortion. But it goes both ways, Serena. If you smash the windows of someone already subscribed, then they unsubscribe. So it it's like a double-edged sword. You can't just throw them willy-nilly. The Grim Reaper's in Paperboy as well. He's like crossing the street. Edgeworth? Who's that? Who's Edgeworth? What's he what's he from and what does he do? Bar, but I don't think I know what it's from. Yell, Yell is drawn him? Who, who is Edgeworth? What does he do? <gasps> style savvy? Oh! Steph loves style savvy. Oh, Ace Attorney. That's the lawyer game, right? I've never played Ace Attorney ever. I think I'd be terrible at it. You made it to a thousand. Oh, Serena, that's amazing. Oh my God, are you pleased? That's great. No, oh, well done. That's a, that's like a, that's a milestone right there. It's such a good game. I'm missing out. I don't like being told I'm missing out. Patches are like missing out when you're reading you Oh, Patches, oh my God. Patches has been a right food monster. Lately, what he does is, uh, <coughs> excuse me, when I uh, sit down to eat, he looks over and he's like, well, sit. And I'm like, Patches, you can't eat that. You're a guinea pig. It's like a burrito or whatever. And he's like, oh, yeah. So then what he does is he starts chasing Creston around and getting Creston all riled up until I go over there and give him a snack. And he's been doing it so much this time. <gasps> Today has been so, he's been a bad boy. I don't know how someone that big can move so fast. I can do the voices for it. Oh, does it not have no voice? No voices? What? What? What does it? Uh, what? What system is it on? I think that's the word I was looking for. And Link's got this, he's got like one of those like crop tops, isn't he? Link! Doesn't he say objection? Isn't that voice acting or is that a different game? Oh, what's up? That's adorable! Oh, Pony! Yes! Let me go have a look. Hold on. In the video discussion, let me go see. Here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Right, hold on. Let me grab that. Oh, that's beautiful hair. Oh, my God. Did you make that, Pony? That looks really cool. Let me go put my new hair on that uh, Pony's made for me. Whoa, ho, ho. I could also have it as a mustache too. I could have two. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I look like James from Pokemon. And the characters are wacky. Is it that good? I knew it was very popular, like, um, a few years ago. I had a friend that was, like, obsessed with it. Let's put some music on. <gasps> Sonic? Yes, please. That clown girl? There's a clown in... In Ace Attorney? Is she like evil? Is she a bad, bad clown? Good clown? Multiple? 
Ooh. There's a circus. Oh! I think I see. Is is this the one? Is that the one with the straps that keeps like snapping their straps on their boobs? I think I saw that on TikTok. She's like snapping her straps on her on her breasts. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. I didn't realize that was Ace Attorney. Oh my god. Her cloobies. No. Don't like that. <laughs> Not cloobies. Sounds like something Scooby-Doo would have. Cloobie-Doo. <laughs> Fake cloobies. <gasps> she doesn't have real ones? Oh no. Is that what the uh, the case was about? Are your boobs real? Yes. Objection! Mm, don't this legs tummy is too low down. It's cool how like circuses have become a thing. Like uh, I felt like towards the late nineties and early two thousands, like circuses were just like. Um, well, they, they weren't really thought of at all, were they? They weren't popular at all, but these days, it's, um... Circuses seem to be making a comeback. She stuffs her bra. We've all been there. Not you, turn at the flex. Everyone's doing such a good job. Oh, my God. Oh, it's a baby. Oh, it's not adorable. A little kind of baby. Oh, he's beautiful. Kirby's another one of those pet characters that he makes noises but doesn't really say anything. It says like Poyo and stuff, doesn't he? Should we zoom out a bit? Oh! Oh my god, all of you guys have got such good taste in game characters. Oh my god. The burp, I love that you've drawn style savvy. Oh god. Rats, how are you doing? You okay? Oh yeah, and Linky, I'm trying to do him in that Gerudo outfit. You know, where the one where he wears the um, the little face covering. It's a shame they didn't get him to wear that again in the... Well, I guess it makes sense in the sequel. He doesn't really need to, does he? But... Link! Link, you look great in your crop top. Put it back on. Nintendo saw the fan art. Hey, they're, uh... They're making their own beds. That they shouldn't have made that Ganondorf so like thick and chunky, should they? They were digging their own graves when they uh, shown everyone rehydrated Ganondorf. Is Link cross dressing? Kind of, Juna. In in the Breath of the Wild one, uh, there's a town of Gerudos, and it's basically like a tribe of women that live in the desert, and they don't let men in. So what Link has to do in that game 
is uh, get one of their outfits and pretend to be a lady to get in. And uh, he wears this, like, um, this outfit similar to theirs, and he wears, like, a covering over his mouth to try and hide his face, and that's how he sneaks in. So it does, especially the la the last two, the uh, the Breath of the Wild one and the Tears of the Kingdom one. I really liked all the stuff they did for that one, for, for those two rather, I should say. Uh, yeah, I thought those were really good. If they saw his pretty boy face, yeah, no, right. Link doesn't have like Link does not have a single hair on his body, does he? I mean. You've played almost oh my god rats i think i don't think i've played i haven't played many oh my god the ones that i have i enjoyed apart from i don't know whether this is controversial but i think i've told you guys it in the past i didn't like twilight princess i don't know whether you guys would agree with me on that or, or burn me on the pyre but uh i didn't like that one the DS ones are the best. Yeah, stuff like Spirit Tracks and ones like that. I haven't played the Minish Cap, no rats, but I, I, apparently that's very popular with a lot of people. I really like the Is that the one where his hat's like a goose? It's the one with really nice pixel art. Is it a Game Boy Advance one, that one? Yeah. Yeah. I'm with you, I'm with you. You could even play that for the first time on stream. Mm. If you guys would be patient, though, I'm not very good at games with puzzles, then. <laughs> You'd have to be patient. Yeah, I promise you won't get mad when I fail the puzzles. You seen what I was doing in Pokemon yesterday? I failed that ice one like a billion times. <laughs> You promise no- you better pro- I ain't doing it unless you guys can promise me you won't get mad. Because I know you guys will get mad. <laughs> wow! Look at that thing. It's like, I'm trying my best, I'm sorry! Who's that, hun? Is that the Kool-Aid man? No! He's a bit of a niche one. Oh! No, no, he's the guy from your train station game. Yeah! <laughs> If it's about trains, I'm like, I am. Oh, rats, that's so sweet. That's actually, I, I do appreciate it. I know some people get a bit, when people play stuff on streams, they get a bit mad if people like backseat. But oh my God, if I'm doing bad, I'm just like, I'm like that. What's that meme that's going around at the minute? That look, you know, it's like a hamster with really big teary eyes. I'm like that when I can't play games. Like, <laughs> I'm so stupid. I love that. I'm glad you guys know which one I'm talking about. Yeah, that's that's me when I have to play a puzzle game. <laughs> Please help me, I'm baby. Not stupid. I'm more of like, um, if you point me in the direction of something that needs killing, I'm, I'm alright at that. I can figure that out. Like, if there's, like, um, mechanics or, like, tactics to figure out how to defeat something, I can do that. But if it's, like, rotate this box in a number of ways to get, like, a, uh, to get, like, this puzzle solved, I'm like, my brain just, like, leaves. It's like, nope. The boba right hamster, yeah. Boba. Guys, if any of you can get the one of like Steph's character, you win a prize. Because <laughs> that is a very, very niche character. It's a very niche special interest. Yeah, like we're talking super niche. <laughs> I'll be ve I, I'll be genuinely very impressed if anyone gets it. Do, 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 do. You drew an awesome character. Do you, want me to, do you want me to have a look at everyone's? Because I haven't done that yet, have I? Let's have a, a proper zoom out and check out all the canvases. Oh! 
The Kirby Lego Lego the Kirby's so cute and happy. I really like him. Steph and I have got uh the Game Boy Kirby pinball games that were in uh, Japanese and they're so cute. Everyone's doing such a good at being. I love Super Saiyan Mario. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god! I know who that is. Let me show Steph. I wonder if she'll remember. <laughs> Snake of the Year. Yeah, Snake of the Year, yeah. Oh, she, <laughs> she remembers. What an icon. That's a throwback, that is. Snake of the Year. <laughs> That's when we were in our mystery box era. I love him, Dank. That was when my mum had sent me angry messages on Facebook afterwards. Yeah. You wasted $20 on this. <laughs> Mom, it's an investment. The video will grow over time. <laughs> like, I don't care if the video is popular. This is a waste of money. This is a waste. It's come on. Oh, these look awesome, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, Kraken, is that the boy from the, uh, the Impact game? The boy? I can't remember. I, what's his name? Boy, 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 man. My boy. I don't know. I don't know. Ben, Venti? Isn't that a type of, isn't that like a size of coffee? That looks awesome. What's going on over here? Oh, boy. Look at little lizard balls, boy, boy. Oh my god, is that Peach? Do you like Peach Crunchy? I like Peach too. Peach, Peach. Please come to the castle. Oh my god! Oh my god! I gotta show Steph this one. Oh, it's a hat. Oh, it is. It's back. He's cute. That's really cute. I love. Oh, Mac's one of my favorite dogs. You like all the dogs. <laughs> well, that's true. But Mac happens to be one of my most favoriteest ones. Oh, that's adorable, Peanut. That's really sweet. I love Mac. He's got markings like a guinea pig as well. What is the Impact game? We played it on a stream, didn't we, when it first came out? Only once. And we were, like, laughing because the girl that lived in the library or something, she had, like, massive boobs. And, like, if you spun her around really fast, her boobs, like, went in, like, a tornado motion. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. You don't know who to draw? Boto, you love drawing Sonic. He's a game boy. Oh, Pony, this was like when it very first came out. So I assume the first massive boobed character that you meet. Froyo, that's awesome. Lisa. Is that Lisa? You've never played something? Well that's fine, Boto. You don't have you don't necessarily have to draw a character from a game that you've played. Like if there's a character in a game that you just like uh like if you just like the aesthetic of, go for it. What's he from? He looks familiar. I honestly, if it's like a PlayStation game, though, I don't think I'm going to get it. He looks like he's from a PlayStation game. Do you recognize who I'm drawing? Oh, that's, um, the hippie dog. Oh, um, no. <laughs> no? No. Like, if you just, if you gave him just, like, a pooch nose, there. Look, it looks just like him. <laughs> <laughs> that's who I thought it was. <laughs> no? Who's that, then? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's sorry, Patches. Oh, I get excited when I first in the game in Italian. 
He's a king. Oh, King Akbar. <laughs> <laughs> He does look like Harvey though. If you gave him a pooch nose and some glasses, that is Harvey. Me and my niche gaming interests. <laughs> He's from Overwatch. Is he like the hamster guy? Isn't there a hamster in Overwatch? Hippie dog. Harvey is a hippie dog. He is. Yeah, that's- I know- I don't know his name, Froyo, but I know who you mean now. Boto, could you draw, um, Freddy Fastbear? Are you good at drawing him? Hamter or Wrecking Ball? Oh, that's awesome. Steph, you're drawing, like, really niche, like, <laughs> hipster, like, oh, this is- It's one of those rare games that you wouldn't know. <laughs> You've probably never heard of this game before. Like, oh, oh. Fastbear, that's his name. Freddy Fast Fastbear. Guys, I, I, I've never played Freddy Fastbear's like um, fast food adventure. What's it called? I can't remember. But I've never played it, so I'm. Freddy Fastbear from the... Im He's not from the Impact game. He has his own one. It's like um, Chuck E. Cheese themed, but it, it's like his own thing. Fastbear. Hey, what? <laughs> None of you are telling me that's his name. Freddy, because he, he runs up to you and spokes you. <laughs> Freddy Fastbear. Is he being a menace? Yeah. I might have to go and, uh... Yeah, he's... he's at me. Go and just, uh, pay some attention to Patches really quickly. He's yeah. been in a right foul mood today. You know he has his moments. Hold on. I'm getting up because he's been a... You've been a four-letter word and I can think of a few. <laughs> you get a cute? That's a four-letter word. Not my baby. You're gonna be a good man. You're so hungry. When you're hungry, you get to, you turn into such a diva. Phaser blast. Phase phase bear. Freddy phase bear. Is he in Fez clan? That'd be cool. Faze Bear. Freddy Faze Bear. Faze, but sounds like fast. Faz. Faz Bear. Freddy Faz Bear. Yeah? I like my name better. I don't think Fast Bear would be it. Fast, fast is like, oh, he's quick, he's gonna get me. Like, that's more scary. Freddy Fast Bear. I like all of your game ideas better. Oh, Cat, that's so sweet of you. Oh my god. That means a lot to me. Freddy isn't fast? Then how do you keep being killed by him? Can't you just outrun him? I never understood why he sounds like a dinosaur. That, is there like a lore reason for why he sounds like a dinosaur? He goes like... Rrr. It sounds like the uh, T-Rex at Jurassic Park. Foxy's the fast one? Foxy Fast Bear? 
Foxy fa phase phase bear rather. He's goofy. Oh no. Foxy does well, she does now. Fair. I seen like people draw ship stuff. Do the do the robots like do they fall in love with one another? Does like Foxy Fast Bear have a crush on like Freddy? Well, they they're robots, aren't they? That's what you guys have been telling me. Aren't they robots? He going to draw a fairy with Link, but he doesn't have a fairy, does he, in um, the Breath of the Wild ones? I hope in the next game, like, he can have a fairy or some kind of friend again. He just looked, he looked very lonely. Oh, yeah, the cop, they didn't have a fairy in his... He, he's the boy without a fairy. What if we brought back the CDI ones? Oh, I'd love to. I'd love to do the voices for the CDI one. Why bore? This piece is what all the warriors strive. I know all the lines. Just hire me now. I know all the lines for it. This piece is what all true warriors strive for. And get get more shoe going. <laughs> I remember when we were playing City Guesser and there was a Moshu guy and he was like, mm. <laughs> so, oh, Moshu, he lives in Germany. Mm. I'm sorry, Link. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little more mm, richer. Yeah, Bean, I've seen it. I haven't played it, but yeah, I have seen that one. It looks awesome. It's such a clever idea. Freddy Fart Bear. You know that exists out there. Oh, that was his name, Cairo, but no one got it. <laughs> He's got like a million like tycoon games, and I've played so many of them obsessively. You do love that. You do love a good uh, Cairo soft game, don't I you? I know there's a new one that's come out on Steam as well, which I need to get hold of. You get to run a, a TV studio, Ooh. and they've got an up and coming one where you get to be in the caverns, and you get to be a cavern tycoon. A cavern tycoon. Yes, yeah. I want to play every tycoon game with Cairo Martin. <laughs> they've got like the same characters that reoccur in like every single game. I think that's cute. That they like in cameo in all the different ones. That's cute. I get excited every time there's a character that I recognise because I'm like, I've met you by the pool before and I've met you <laughs> Oh my god, it's King Akbar, he's here! <laughs> I love King Akbar, he spent so much money in my airport. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like the Nancy Drew games, yeah. We played an anti Drew game once, didn't we? On stream. Now Link's saying, Look, I am one!
This is supposed to be music from games, but I'm pretty sure this is Moonlight Sonata. Isn't this Beethoven? Oh yeah, doesn't it have like frilly bits at the bottom? Beethoven in Smash. That'd be amazing, like a Smash Brothers, but with ancient, with like uh, classical composers. Yeah, you're a Beethoven main. What Beethoven's final smash thing? Oh, well, he did Moonlight Sonata. Maybe he could do something with the moon. The Beethoven beat down. He just beat you up with a piano. <laughs> yeah, it'd be like one of those like old cartoons where a piano just falls from the sky. <laughs> Would be you got but a lot of people like back, don't they? How come you guys all like back? What's your favorite back's uh, music? Baby got back. Baby got back. Is that one of his neural ones? I don't think I've heard that one. Would they yell, yell lines in their native language? Well, I don't know. Well, Beethoven was deaf, so I don't know. Backstreet's back? Boto, how long have you been sitting on that one? See, Boto, with a brain like that, this is why you need to go to university. The world needs minds like that. <laughs> oh no, actually, I don't think you would see his ear, because he has like a hood on. So let's get rid of that. Is this playing again? Moonlight's even Moonlight's not, not this long. Okay, now we just, oh my god, Destros! We do these like uh, canvas things every Wednesday, so if you want to hang out and draw, oh my god, you're more than welcome to.
Rats, who's who's the fish? Who's what's he called? Because some of you guys are drawing ones that I don't recognize. Oh! That's Frisk, look! Is it Freddy Fish? Freddy Fastbear Fish? Because you get to sleep. Oh, this, that's fine. No, I appreciate you here today. Oh my god. It's lovely to be with us. So does Freddy Fazbear have a fish too? It's from the 90s. Oh! Oh wow, it's like an old school one then. What what does the uh, fish get up to? What kind of game did what kind of game is it, I guess I should say? Link has blue eyes, doesn't he? For some reason I keep thinking he has green. Guys, do you remember when Link used to have pink hair? Like in the late 80s when Link's canon hair was pink. We need to bring that back. It's first person shoe. We've got the, the fish? Is it like a Doom one? That's, that sounds pretty cool. Hi, Infinity, how are you doing? Your childhood favourites. Are they like learning games then? Is that what they do? And they're kind of... That's, see, I've never, never heard of them before. That's pretty interesting. Oh, I made the menu disappear again. Where's it gone? Can you tell me why it's start? Oh, Jesus. Where did all the brushes go? I messed that up. Oh, oh, did you draw Isabel? Yeah. Well, that's really cute looking, and I really like that. I'm still cross at Isabel. Why? She don't do nothing. She's one of those people that turns up at work and looks busy all day. She doesn't do nothing. She drinks tea. She sleeps. <laughs> She's cute. That's not fair. You don't hire someone because they're cute. <laughs> Is that what she's doing? Is she earning her wage from her looks alone? She does a good job of it. She's an emo Oh, she's emotional support. For, for like Tom Nook. It's Tom oh, is Tom Nook anxious? Oh no, I don't like that idea. Don't like the idea of Tom Nook being anxious. Is there any video games that have possums in? Because I know you, uh, a few of you guys like to draw a good possum. Possum games. Yeah, is there any possum games? You'd think there would be, especially these days. Some possums are quite popular, aren't they? We could have like a cute one where it's a girl possum. She's called Penny Possum. That's yeah. cute. <laughs> Do you like that name? Man? And she has to like uh, rummage around in bins for treasure and stuff. So, you know, stuff that um, stuff that possums do. And she babysits baby possums, and then she has to carry them on her back, like you see in the wild. First possum shooter, Caitlin. Oh my god! I don't want anyone shooting at the possum. <laughs> oh, I recognise the fish, Freddy Fish. I used to play those games when I was a kid. Oh, I, I, yeah. We were just talking. I didn't know who that was, but have you played that before? Yeah, when I was a kid, and I used to go to my mum's friend's house. She used to put me on the computer and make me play Freddy Fish to shut me up and give me a nice pop. Oh no way! I and did. Then I had... go gossip downstairs for hours. I had no idea who that was. This it's a complete mystery to me. I didn't know who it was.
Oh, tuna raccoons are cool too. Isn't that Kirby cute in the top left one? Yeah, I really Isn't like that it. lovely? This is what we do sometimes after the streams as well. Um, we look around at the possums and just compliment you all behind your back. <laughs> Put put goes to the zoo. Well, that sounds cute. Big Tyler's playing some of those. Put put. Oh my god, it's Freddy Fazbear. That it's him. Stardew Pooch. Oh my god. Oh, these are normal. The diddle on page four. <laughs> Is that who? Oh, good, yeah. Oh my god, that looks like official, like, diddles art. Not diddles. How many of you guys know what diddles is? Steph had to teach me all about that. Okay. I thought I'd have Oh, yeah, so you should have seen me. I was just like a primordial glob when Steph met me. That's so cute looking. Is Diddleina like Diddle's like boyfriend? Diddleina's his girlfriend. Really? Or at least she was in my universe. They were in love. <laughs> That's cute. Sad because he isn't fair. Is that Freddy Fast Bear? Oh no, he's sad. Freddy Sad Bear. <laughs> Oh no! He has a microphone. Does Freddy sing? Does Freddy like? To, does he like to sing songs? Freddy's the he's the he's the lead singer. Really? Oh, this looking so cool. Oh my god. I'm learning about Freddy Fastbear lore. Are you guys proud of me? He's the fastest bear alive. Revolver Ocelot. Oh, he's the cowboy in the uh, Metal Gundam Gear Mecha game. He's like a cowboy that has guns, right? <gasps> really? For oh, God, Frodo, nice. Which one did you do? Who's the sniper lady in Metal Gear? Because, like, isn't, isn't it a thing, like, you're supposed to kill that sniper girl? But you can, like, just choose to stand around? Like, that's messed up. Oh, the shepherd dog. Oh, nice. No, no, not quiet. It's like some other one. It's like from the from the older ones. I remember watching it on, like, TV. That's, this is how old it was. And there's like a woman who has a sniper and um, you beat her and then Snake has to like kill her. But you, you can like just do like whatever. You can just stand around. You can sit down. Sniper Wolf? Is that where SSSSS Sniper Wolf got her name from? Really? Oh my god, no way! <laughs> 
<laughs> so weird. Is that Ganon? Is he back? He's like, no, no, that the Rudolph told me about you. Hot damn. <laughs> Or to be rehydrated. I forgot in a previous stream, like Link and Ganondorf were like hooking up and stuff. I forgot about that. I think the softness doesn't look too good. Let's get rid of you got, you got You've got rats called Lincoln Ganon. That's adorable. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so sweet, rats. Oh my god, I love that. Their rescues. Oh. I uh, watched a TikTok thing today about a guinea pig that was rescued from a from a, a motorway. Believe it or not, oh. and um, it it was like a TikTok thing where it told you the whole story of it. And um, at the end, all all it wanted to do was cuddle with its new friends. It was so sweet. He just wanted to cuddle with his new with his new pig friends. And he was by himself as well, which made me really angry. Like at the start, he was by himself. Hairless rats and they love cuddles. Oh the baby. I mean it had a happy ending, but it should have had a happy beginning, you know? But that doesn't go just for guinea pigs either. I, I don't. Oh, I could go on a rant all day. I don't know how people can do it. Like, go to the trouble of buying and adopting an animal and then just dumping it somewhere. I don't, I don't get it. Because, like, even, even if you can't afford it, there are places that you can go to safely, like, leave it with people. I, there's no excuse for it. It makes me mad. There's not very many things that make me really angry, but that's definitely one of them. There was another rescue one of guinea pigs that were left in uh, one of the big parks in um, in London. I can't remember which. I don't know if it was Saint James's Park, maybe. But this person found these two guinea pigs and they were living in a hollowed out tree. I know, yeah. Yeah, they were living in a hollowed out, you know, like at the base of the tree. It was like a little hollow, they were living in there. And they got rescued, which was really nice. That's it, Lago. That's why I need to win the lottery so I can have a guinea pig sanctuary. And we don't rehome them, I just keep them all for myself. <laughs> People will be like, oh, do you rehome guinea pigs here? I'll be like, no. <laughs> no, they stay here with me. No. It's time for drink water. That's a good call, actually. Have you guys been drinking your water today and not your coffee? Ugh. Did you say that I drew Link as well? Oh my god, no, hold on, I, I want to see. You love car- oh, Kraken. I can't- I don't want to deny you guys things that you love. Oh, there he is! <laughs> oh, I look at- I like how he- it looks like the scene out of, um, you know, Toy Story where he drops Woody and he's like, I don't want to play with you anymore. <laughs> and Link's like, no! Looks like that. I don't want to play with Lonk anymore. <laughs> Rehydrated Ganon's just dropped. That's a really good link, hun. This really, really good. 
You've done so many. God, you guys are way faster. I'm really slow. I must drive you nuts watching me draw by myself because <laughs> I take forever to do anything. I think traditionally you're a lot faster at drawing than you are digitally. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah, a lot. Oh, Lego, but that's very sweet of you, though, to re to like to realize that and do that for them. That's very, very sweet. Like, of course, that must have been very tough as well for you personally, but you still did it knowing that was best for the uh, for the bun. I think that's very sweet of you. Where the heck is my... And I'm proud of myself because I've started to catch up on Doodle Day Extra and uploads for the past 30 days straight. Superwoman. With thumbnails, no less. Oh my god. Who is she? I know I've really outdone myself this time. You need my anime girl powers? What's up, Voto? Oh my god, Sam, that's adorable! Gandalf is giving him a flower! Ganon would totally be one of those guys that goes to like the biggest mountain to get the rarest flower. You can't draw anime girls? What anime girl are you trying to draw, Boto? Oh my god, I love the Suavemente Ganon. Suavemente. That's the only thing I can say. All the other stuff he says is too fast. I can't make it out. Oh, Jaden, yet the Great Wall that don't even get me started. You'd think, like, one of the nine wonders of the world, or however many there are, you'd think that'd be all over the map, but no. It's almost as if they don't want you to find it. It's not that hard. Yes, it is, Cat. This is why you're in prison. You're making up, making unreasonable demands. Oh, Peanut, are you drawing the Minecraft wolf? <gasps> Do you know that they've released an update for that now? So you can get different coloured wolves? Oh. Yeah, they're different coloured ones now. I need to play that. I know you used to be able to have like, different coloured collars. Oh god, look at your link. Sam's giving him a little friend. Go oh. Gone on. It's <laughs> <laughs> two little boys. It looks like Gonon's actually enjoying himself. <laughs> It's, um, Boto, isn't that... Oh my god, this is terrible, because this is the only thing I know about them. Isn't this the girl from the game that <laughs> that hangs herself in that, um... It's like, it's meant to look like a cute anime game. Doggy Doggy Literature Club. Yes, yeah, it's that one. I've never watched it or anything, but I just know that it's like an iconic name in the game. In yeah. Game. Oh, Angel, thank you for the raid. How are you doing? Yeah, Boto, I recognised it straight away. De def definitely with the hair. The hair especially. 
Yeah, that looks awesome in your style, Boto. That looks great. Oh, Lego, that's adorable. That's the Twilight. That's her. Uh, what's um? She's the uh, she's like the Mary Sue pony, isn't she? She's like perfect, and she has all the special powers. No? Am I thinking of the wrong one? With the wolf up there? Yeah, Boba Boba, did you, did you go and have a look? There's all kinds of different colours and stuff now. Oh, it's amazing. She's the nerdy pony. Oh, she's the one with the glasses. It's not Mary Sue. <laughs> uh, you know, I don't know. I don't. Everything I know about My Little Pony, I think, has come from you guys, so. See, so Unicorns gets it. She's kinda. I love that wolf, though. That's well cute. Just Dance, that's amazing! Oh my god, you guys have such good taste. <gasps> Crunchy, oh my god! So that's Peach. That's definitely Daisy. Who's this? Oh, those ones look so pretty. Who's this melancholy princess on the right? Who's that? Is she Rosalina? Oh, yeah, she is quite the emo princess, isn't she? Crunchy, that if you're still here, those are really good. I always love the shapes that you do. They're really nice. And like Crunchy's done, don't be shy to put your uh, usernames. If you, uh, want to, you want to promote yourself while we're streaming, don't be shy. Make sure to put it on there. Be, be like Crunchy. Oh, oh, oh my god, Jaden, that's really pretty. Ooh, look, look how clean the lines are. Oh my god. And I'm going, yeah, Bower Bird. Huge same. Oh, these look awesome. A lot of main characters end up being a Mary Sue. Was Goku a Mary Sue? Oh, oh my word, thank you for the bits. That's really sweet of you. Now, I think the Gerudo outfit's blue, isn't it? I think. Oh no, Goku couldn't have been a Mary Sue because he nearly died of a heart attack. A Mary Sue wouldn't, like, let that happen. I always remember that episode where Goku forgot to take his heart medication and he, like, had a heart attack. Didn't he come back to life? No, didn't like what's his name? Like what was his name? Uh like Tim. He, he Tim went back in time and uh he told it told Goku to take his heart medication. It's not Tim. What was his name? Tim Henman. Tim Henman. Famous tennis player. Uh, player Tim Henman went back in time. Mm -hmm. 
Saitama. Oh, from one punch. And now he can't because he's bold. Tim Pants? <laughs> What is Dragon Ball about? Death oh my god. Well, that that's an entirely thing in, in of itself. Like, Dragon Ball is completely different from Dragon Ball Z, which is, like, the really well-known one. But yeah, in Dragon Ball Z, there's, like, space and time travel and all, all kinds of crazy stuff. Yeah, and saving the world and stuff. That's true, yeah. He does all that kind of thing. And he eats beans. See, that's why Goku is really cool. You know how he gets himself all better? He eats beans. It is, it's true to, oh my god, it's like a whole like alternate timeline where Goku doesn't take his heart medication and dies and the world ends. <laughs> because these androids come and take over the world. <laughs> it's like, Goku, you dummy, take your heart medication. He's like, I don't want to. <laughs> See, that could happen in this dimension, guys, if you don't take your medication. What if something happens to you, and then, like, aliens or robots come and take over the world because you weren't around? Even if I am around, there's nothing I'm going to do. Jaden! It's like, Jaden, do the Kamehameha. I don't wanna. But, but we'll die. No. I don't wanna. You have to save the world. We'll give you all of our energy. We'll put our hands in the air. And like you suck the energy up. And that's how that's how you'll win. What are you meant to do against the aliens, Boto? Um, blast them. I know what you guys are like, though. Like, it's... <laughs> if the world was ending and Goku needed your energy and he wanted you to raise your hands in the air... You won't even unshrimp from your chairs. And Goku's like, give me your energy. You're like, oh, I don't want, I don't want to move. Like, oh, Goku, do I have to do it now? It's like, the world's going to end. We need your help. Oh, I just got comfy. <laughs> don't call me out. I was comfy and you moved me. Oh, Galactica, thank you very much for resubbing. How are you doing?
<laughs> oh my god, did the... Boto, did you get auto modded again? I have to admit, it's been a while. Have you been trying have you been talking in capitals again? Is that it? The auto mod just can't handle how passionate Boto talks. You're getting used to... Oh, yeah, because didn't over in America, didn't you have your daylight savings recently? Ours hasn't happened yet, which is really confusing. So, like, our time zones are, like, even closer together now, which is really strange. Oh, you're taking part in a competition? Ooh. What's the competition you're doing? We just sent up rats. That's like, that's like Chad moves. Not letting time dictate you. Well, wouldn't that be crazy? What, what, how do you think the world would react right? You know, there are places in the world that don't observe like daylight savings and stuff. What'd you do if, like, scientists went out there and they realized that people that don't acknowledge that, like, live longer? Like, if they deny that time is, like, a thing and they live longer? Do you think the world would go, like, nuts? We don't do it here at all. Oh my god, says rats as their skin glows one like youthfully. Oh my god, it's time to bow out for ten minutes? How do I undo that? I should really learn how to mod, shouldn't I? It's because you're all so well behaved. I never have to learn how to mod, do I? And then when something like this happens, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I mean, I know how to do the important stuff. Like, if you're really naughty. I know how to, like, ban you guys. Well, Lex, thank you for the, uh, for the resub. How are you doing? I don't think there's a mod here today. It's not too out of the ordinary, though. Like I say, you're in safe hands. I, if anything does go super wrong, I, I can, I know what to do. Don't worry. I'll look after you. Oh my god, Voto, Voto switched accounts. That's a big brain move. Six, oh my god, there's like money prize? That's awesome. I hope you win. Oh, Boto, that's awesome. I'll be rooting for you. I hope you win. I know a few of you guys uh, these days have entered like uh, competition things and won, so I have every faith in you guys. Who did my hair, Lex? It was a uh, pony. Pony did my uh, my beautiful hairstyle that I've got today. Yeah, isn't it amazing? I 
I'm very lucky. Whenever you guys, like, uh, obviously sometimes you guys will, like, find something on Google if it's, like, a game or something that we're playing, but I'm very lucky that you guys take the time to uh, draw some of the things for me to wear as well, because you all do such a good job. Paul Scott, a Scott Mayer, I think. Thank you for the follow. How are you doing? Like we, yes, Boto. Just like child divorce Eggman. I still can't get over how much you made the background one look like Peter Griffin. That was like so cool. Lex, you made yourself a sticker prompt box. That will be so happy. <laughs> That sounds really awesome. It's become really popular, like because you know, like when we upload and we've, I try to do like at least one. Uh, people have gotten really into that recently, which is awesome. I'm glad that you guys have uh, been enjoying them. I'm always like scared. I'm always like, oh my god, what the heck's gonna be in this? And I can never guess what it is. And that was the thing that started from when I went on like my vacation back home for the week. Yeah, when you were visiting family, yeah. Be something to keep you entertained while I was gone. Keep me entertained? What am I like a monkey or something? Because <laughs> you're like, I don't know what I do with myself when you're away. Keep the monkey entertained. It is true, I didn't know what to do with myself, you aren't wrong. You watched a lot of gladiators. I did. I, I did. I watched a lot of gladiators with you guys, if you remember that. Isn't that crazy that in July that's going to be a year ago already? Where does the time go? A generator version? Oh, I guess that'd be doable, yeah. If you just put like a ton of prompts like into a generator thing, that could work. I hope you guys are proud of me that I'm actually coloring something in on one of these for once. Normally by the time I've sketched something out, I get annoyed with how the pen works and I stuff. <laughs> it's like, oh, the hell with this? But no, you guys are pushing yourselves, so I should do it too. I've drawn lots in this. You've done, hey, I ain't got no problems with you, hun. You've done loads. We're very proud, old man. Thank you, Boto. I guess you could say I really rizzed it up this week. I guess like I can hear, I can hear Boto like crumple like a packet of crisps every time I say like a riz. <laughs> You decided to, oh, Lex, that's awesome. 50 cents, though? Oh my god, that's amazing. Do you, are you guys kind of like Steph in that when you get like uh, new stickers and stuff, do you then struggle to like commit and put them in something so they just sort of stay laid out somewhere? Luckily, that prompt book thing helped to alleviate that a little bit. She was like, oh, yeah, I could put it in this. Yeah, really? Well, take it from Steph. If you do make a sticker prompt book, it's helped her to use them. So it could, could be worth. Yeah, Brats, those look great. It'd be cool to do a video on something like that sometime. Sitting by your skin. Two months, Boto, for real? What is it that it, that gets you? Is it like, are you scared that, say, have you got like a really good sticker and you're scared you're going to waste it? Is that what it is? Are you scared that when it's down, it's like down forever? Oh, confetti. Oh, good luck. That sounds amazing. Oh, I hope that goes well for you. That'll be exciting. Hey, 
and you won't use it. It's not ruined if you if you put a sticker on something, guys, that's not quite where you wanted it to be. It doesn't mean that that sketch box ruined forever. <laughs> You doing the boba ride hamster meme when you put your sticker like two inches the wrong way. Like, whoa. Have bad vibe. Oh, wow. Pit. That's like, um, Boto, that's like uh, an OCD thing. Like, um, that sounds similar to when. Have you guys ever experienced this where if you hold something, say you pick up a cup and then you put it down and you can you still like feel the cup in your hand and that feeling won't go away until you wash your hands. So it's like it's all right. <laughs> no, it's apparently it's very common. Or if you touch something and then you can still feel it on your hands and that won't that feeling won't go away until you wash your hands. <laughs> really? Oh, there we go. Bean gets it. Yeah, unicorns. That's a similar thing. Yeah. Too many sims. Oh, bless you. Well, whatever it is, Boto, we love you just the way you are. Don't you worry. When you get into uni, you need to... Well, that's fine. It's, you know, all in good time. Because, like, Boto, especially if you're doing all your university and stuff, like, um, I don't care what anyone says, when you're trying to apply to university and you're hearing back, and that's like a full-time job in itself. So, yeah, by all means, you know, when you get settled in and everything, like, uh, go for it, go for it. If you feel, like, ready and you feel like you're able to have a look into it, I'd say go for it. And there's no shame as well, like, guys. Guys, if you ever get diagnosed, you know, with OCD, autism, or, you know, AD, whatever, there ain't no shame in it. You're still you. This is, like, what I would tell Steph. When she was getting therapy and being diagnosed and stuff, she was like, oh, you won't think less of me, will you? And I'm just, and I'm just like, you're still you. We just understand you better now than what we did before. Like, nothing's changed. And that goes, to, that, that's the same with you guys. It's just better understanding yourselves. You can't get you diagnosed in jail. <laughs> we'll bust you out one day when you've learned your lesson. money yeah it's so no it is true it's the same here as well like um i think we've talked about it before haven't we um in england obviously we have uh, the nhs which is the tax funded health service that you don't have to pay for but obviously because it's free it's very popular and that's why waiting times are so long but you can also obviously go private which is similar to uh, how things are in america which is quicker but then obviously it's very expensive. But yeah, like I say, I like I've made peace with the fact that I'm too poor to ever get an autism diagnosis. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> so I'll never 100% know, but I've had a few people suggest that the fact that it is, so. Who knows? Yeah, it's like, we don't want to, like, oh god, I don't want to discourage anyone. Like, Steph's been on a waiting list for it for four years. But I don't want that to discourage anyone. Technically, it was first mentioned in 2017. Yeah, the first mentioning of it, yes. Seven years ago, so. <laughs> 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 I'm the streamer. I'm supposed to be saying, like, give me money. Boto, you're the only person I've ever seen that's come to a stream and asked the streamer for money. <laughs> what a role reversal. Streamer, give me the money. Yeah, 
be nice to have it on paper. No, Lego, I... You know, I totally relate to that, because recently Steph and I have been going through things to help Steph with me being her carer. And uh, we sort of got the ball rolling with this back in, like, uh, October, November of last year. And literally last week is when it finally became official that I'm, like, officially, like, Steph's trusted care person. It took that long, but it feels so nice to have it officially down on paper somewhere so people are like if Steph ever does need help or whatever I'm I'm on there it's more of a peace of mind for me than Steph if I'm on it. <laughs> but yeah that that took that took a really long time what does being a carer do well a lot of people a lot of people are carers without even realizing it's like if you help someone that you live with in day-to-day -day stuff Technically, you're already a carer, so if you help someone with their meals, or remind them to take their medication, or you help them, like, bathe or get dressed, you know, just anything in helping in the day-to-day -day life of someone that you live with uh, does class you as a carer. But getting officially, like, marked down governmentally in this country, for whatever reason, just took ages. Took a long time for me to get, like, permission to access Steph's medical things as well, but I get that, but that took a really long time as well. And so I can do all of her phone calls and stuff for her. Yeah, League of, yeah, more of a League of Unicorns, yes, yes. Oh, Boto, that's disgusting. They definitely do. You really do have to fight, like, tooth and nail. Oh, Lego, I totally agree. Like, a one, like, ADHD sort of thing that Steph has. Um, and it has, it has a name, but I can't remember the name, but you guys will probably know what it is. Like, um... Like for today, for example, we had our house inspection that I was telling you yesterday about. And the housing inspection was at half past ten this morning. And Steph gets this thing where um, if there is something that has to be done at a set time, she can't do anything until that's been done. So, so Steph got up at like uh, half eight or nine. And then she, she was like, I can't do anything until this has been done. So she just sort of sat at her computer and she was like, I can't I, I can't do anything until this has been done. And I was like, oh, that's fine. You know, you're up. That's the main thing. But it, it, it's got a word, but I don't know what it's called. But yeah, Steph gets that quite a bit. Yeah, yeah, like it's a point. Yeah, it's it. Oh, it's it. I knew you guys would get it. <laughs> I knew you guys would understand. Let's go see what Steph's been doing. Where have you been? Oh, have you gone on a different page? Have you mm -hmm. done? Oh, let's go. Where is she? I'm just looking for Steph. <laughs> what the heck is that? <laughs> Owner and the really big tuna. Pod Pod Jackson saying poggers. Trying to have a serious mental health conversation over here. And you're busting out Owner and the really big tuna. <laughs> That is pretty cool. You know you'd play it. <laughs> <laughs> that is cute, man. <laughs> My friends get confused when you want to meet early with the days away. Yeah, yeah, photo, yeah. But even I'm like that. Yeah, I like to do things really early. One thing that I like to do, I don't know if it's like that or if it's like something else, but I love going to like shops and stuff literally just as they open and there's no one the that might be just because i hate like you know oh, i hate people in shops you know when they stop in front of you oh my god just want to like liberate them with their legs like if you're not going to use them <laughs> yeah loud crowded places yeah i'm not i'm not a fan of those yeah so if i can go to a store or something as it opens just get straight in and out oh and then I can walk past all the people that are going into that store. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's Chica. 
Is Cheeker is Cheeker uh, a Freddy Fast Bear? Well, you know what I mean. She she's not Freddy. She's is she a chicken? You like Barney? So does Freddy have friends? One day I just need to... I, I should go to Wikipedia and read it with you guys. And then I can have a Q&A with you guys. <laughs> oh no, and the really big too. I forgot to say. <laughs> There's different animatronics, really? Oh, 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 you're back. Yeah, but I can I can see what you're saying. I love this page, guys. I like this one's like it's so color. I mean, the first page always tends to be like the busiest one, but I really like how colorful this one is. And again, don't be afraid to put your uh, your handles and stuff, regardless of what page that you're on. It's the least I can do if you're choosing to hang out and draw for a bit. At least promote yourselves a little bit. Oh my god, it's him! It's Master Roshi! I like that pony that Lago did. That's that's cute pony. You you guys are so good at drawing like the pony bodies. Like when I draw them, it looks I look like the ponies look like they got rickets or something. It's not good. Wanted to show you a picture. Hold on. Is there a picture of like all? Oh, here we go. That's a pretty good picture. I want that. No. I'm trying to save a picture to show you something. Hold on. That's a good picture. Oh my god. Hold on, hold on. This will be worth it because I wanted to show you this when uh, we were talking about it earlier. Hold on. Here we go. Look at him! Isn't that amazing? Can I send art pieces to the disc? Yeah, you can put, in, put it in the artwork or the fan art one, uh, Lego. Yeah, that's fine. Look at him. That's amazing. I think there are like nine different kinds now. I like how the baby wolves are just like smaller ones with giant heads. It reminds me of guinea pigs when they're babies. The forest, yeah, I like the forest one as well. It seems like such an obvious thing that should have been in the game for like ages. I'm just glad that it's a thing now. Yeah, right, I wasn't too bothered until it was like, oh, <laughs> wait a minute. The Savannah one, I mean, who am I kidding? They're all really nice. I wonder if someone will mud it so, like, you can crossbreed them and the colours will change. Or if that even happens automatically, I don't know. They have a hyena coat pattern. Best Roboto, you love those. Yeah, that's so cute. I'm so glad I got to share that with you. So cute.
There's a hamster mod. There's a guinea pig mod as well now, and they drop a fertilizer, like little guinea pig pokes that you can use on crops. It's really cute. <laughs> and they even make like guinea pig like weak sounds and stuff. They go whoop whoop whoop. It's really cute. Right, where's me? I'm heading layers, but where, where are they? Because what I'm trying to do, even if it's just very, very simple, just some kind of a. Uh, whether it's an outline or a background or whatever, we'll see. Oh, we got Voltron, that's amazing! Hello, Riesha, how are you doing? What do you mean I'm still alive? <laughs> what, what was what were you planning? Surprise, you're still alive. It's like, yay! Links against the wall and posing. It's like, oh, do you come here often again? And it's like, well, I was born here. You did? Bolton, that's awesome. I love it. Did not cut out the bleed through page. Oh, that's fine. I put it there just in case. Like I, I was like, oh, if I don't put one, people might be like, oh. But no, you don't have to cut out the bleed through page if you don't want to. I won't get mad. I've got the one out in your color. Well, I'm glad that you did because it was kind of like a demonstration in that screen <laughs> that we did. So yeah, I am. I'm kind of glad that you did. Um, find it challenging to draw small so try best to make room oh my god that's fine i always say like if you guys start to struggle for a uh, room i don't mind like shrinking my down or erasing mine <laughs> boto i swear to god i'm drinking look can you hear it water Oh, Riesha, that's very sweet of you. <laughs> that's really sweet. Maximum hydration. It's Boto gets like this sometimes. Boto just likes the idea of like waterboarding me. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh my! Yeah, this is this is cyberbullying. This is this is mean. I'm being cyberbullied on the internet. Is this because I called Freddy Freddy Fastbear? I, like, I didn't know his name. I just need to make sure. This is because I said Riz earlier. This is what this is about. Oh, a stretch rat, so that's actually a really good call. You guys don't know, do you? Every time a hydrate's like uh, redeemed, that's that goes for you guys as well. That's not just for me, that's for you. I'm stretching my wristies. You guys should stretch your hands as well. I bet you haven't. I bet most of you haven't stretched your hands in like a week. Stretching out the shrimp pose all of Jaden's vertebrae are like cracking one after the other. Oh. Look at 
Ooh, you find your... Oh, that's... Oh, Walkman one, Riesha. That's awesome. I've been thinking about getting a cassette player or something one day. I'd like to put, like, music that I've made onto, like, a cassette or something. I guess just for the novelty of it more than anything. That's a very romantic idea. Hmm. I mean, well, I used to do it as a kid anyway. Because... Oh, God. Because that was the only technology that existed. I don't want to hear no... Oh, it's an old bad... Look. Country girls make do. And that's what we had to do back then. I did bean, yeah. And I was I am still sad about it. Because Akira Toriyama passed away and this guinea pig that I've been following for like eight years on Twitter, he passed away as well. So, oh, Simon. Yeah, so Twitter's like dead to me now. Everything that was good on Twitter is gone. I feel that on a personal level, poor gun to country girl had to make it. That's what they do. I, I learned, someone said that on uh, TikTok and it's just stuck in my head ever since country girls make do. <laughs> I don't even know what it was from. I just remember this woman saying it. I was like, yeah, that really resonates with me. <laughs> it's from a meme? Is that where it's from? It's kind of explicit, is it? Oh god, no, I've been saying that quite a lot. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no, Sparkle, no! I had something happen to me as well, actually, I wanted to tell you about. Um, I want to know if I give off this vibe that I apparently have been told that I give off. Um, granted, I hadn't shaved and my hair was a bit messy, because it was the morning. And I went to go and bring the bins back because it was trash day. So I went out and I brought them back. And there was an old lady struggling with hers. And I said, like, oh, do you need help with it? And I helped her. And then I, I assume her husband, it was an old guy, came around. And he was like, oh, you've done that quick. And the old lady goes, oh, this lovely eccentric man helped me. <laughs> and I was, oh, thanks. What, what do you mean? What's that? I was I was being nice. What does that mean? Eccentric man? Kind, handsome, modest man. Mm. She called she called me out. It sounds like a compliment. Thank you, cat. I'll take it as a compliment. Like, oh, this eccentric man helped me. Maybe she meant to say handsome and got, got confused or something. This handsome, strapping man who looks surprisingly young for his age. Help me get this bin in. I think it means fancy. <laughs> I'll take that. Fancy is good. But I wanted to ask you guys about it. You guys have your finger on the pulse when it comes to uh, compliments and things. So I was like, I oh, know, I'll ask these guys. She's heard the names I get on my mail. I hope not. I had something, but I had something that I ordered for Steph today because you know, um. Steph and I share a Prime membership thing, and it's in my name. So if Steph needs like new yarn and stuff, I'll get it for her. And, um, she, she had some, we filmed it, she had some, um, yarn delivered today. And the person that had sold it had vacuum sealed it so it'd fit through the letterbox, which is a pretty good idea. But when it shipped in this, let me show you how it looked. It, but when you ship it out in a hot pink parcel, and the yarn's kind of, like, been shrink-wrapped, and it looks like this. <laughs> it was like, hmm. 
a package for me? <laughs> it's like, I can't really, and they, oh god. And it's like, when I came back upstairs, I was like, here's your mail. <laughs> it's like, oh jeez. Boop, 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 boop. Looks like song. <laughs> oh my god! Oddish, that is not a fun time. It would it would tear you in two. Discreet packaging. Oh my god, it was like that thing of that guy. I think it was a guy in America who lived in a shared apartment and he left like his packaging in the uh, shared recycling. It was like a big, it was like a big box and it had a picture of a bum on it and it said like 50 pounds of ass. <laughs> Surely you'd want to tear that up and not just put the whole box in the recycling. <laughs> Like, tear it up or, or, like, put it in bits. Jeez. Oh, God. Keep it. 50 pounds. 50 pounds of ass. Oh, God. What is that in kilos? That's, that's a lot of ass. That's one bit. That's a, that's a behemoth of a dumpy. We're talking bit. Well, like what? Fifty pounds. Like if you're a one hundred and fifty pound like female. That's a third of your weight being dedicated to one area. That's that's dense. <laughs> Contact this big. I'm guessing it's silicon. Well, I'd be it's horrified if it was like a real one. Just like a cut off bum in the mail. Ooh. Dense cheeks. I wish I could show you the bar. I wish I could show you it. Like, because someone took a photo of it like in their basement apartment recycling, but it's too explicit to put on Twitch. <laughs> Fifty thousand pounds of ass. isn't that like over like a isn't that like a few tons? Literal metric tons of ass. <laughs> God, it'd be delivered in a crate. You want an artist, Rico? I could try and draw one up here for you. Because it was, here we go, let's get a little brush. Because they took it in like a, it had like the, it had like a table like this. I'm sure it was like this, it had like the table. And it had like boxes, you know, for your recycling and stuff that had stuff put in. But then this box was like awkwardly jutting out at an angle like this in one of the boxes. So it was like it was like sticking out like that. It'd just been haphazardly chucked in this recycling thing. And there is like no joke. There was like just a, pi a, a picture of a giant butt. And it had like one of those big like flash sale things. And it said like 50 pounds of ass. <laughs> Seriously, it looked just like this. It's like they were so excited to get their hands on it. They like ripped the box open, just threw the box and ran away with it. Oh, 
<laughs> my eyes would have shut. <laughs> oh my god, that's a big dumpy. Slams bedroom door. What do you even do with that? Do you like dress it up first? I wouldn't even know what to do. Do you take like the giant ass out to dinner? I wonder if you could like put it in your own trousers and make it look like your ass. So you got like a really big one. <laughs> oh my god, what is this descended into today? <laughs> oh my god. Right, my chickadees. It's time for me to run away, but I really appreciate you hanging out with me for this one. This one's been really fun. I've loved seeing you guys' take on game characters. Because I, I always say your styles are like so unique to yourselves. It's cool seeing those characters and how you would draw them. Yeah, everything's looked awesome today. You should be really proud of yourselves. So thank you for hanging out with me. We'll be uploading on Sunday. And if I do any other streams, obviously, I shall let you know in the Discord. So... Enjoy the rest of your week. Have fun. And I will see you guys very soon, okay? Bye-bye.